morning, y'all. It's Miss Angela. Happy Monday. Um, today we are going to be making cereal. And so I chose my favorite cereal, which is Lucky Charms. And then I am going to be using 1% milk. And then the other things that you're going to be needing are a bowl, a spoon, and then a measuring cup. Um, so for cereal, the way you want to look at it is you want to make sure that the if used by date is good. So mine says best if used by February 22nd of 2021. So this is still good and in date. And then you also want to check your milk. And the milk is typically going to be up at the top. I don't know if you can see that little number. Um, but mine says April 27th. And today is April 13th. So we are also good with the milk. Both of those are in date and they're not expired. And so the next thing that you're going to want to look at is on your box of cereal and this little white area, the nutrition label, there is going to be a serving size. And so your serving size for Lucky Charms is one cup of cereal or it can be 36 grams. And so what that means is you are either going to get your measuring cup. Um, so this is my one cup measuring cup. I don't know if y'all can see this. Uh, it says one cup. Or the way that I typically do my cereal is I measure it with a scale. Um, I have just a little food scale and that's how I do it. Um, but today I'm going to use a measuring cup. Um, so I have my bowl and then my cereal says one serving of Lucky Charms is one cup like I have right here. So what I'm going to do is open up my cereal box and I'm just going to cut open the corner. Um, just to help keep it fresh a little bit longer. And then I'm going to pour it in. And then so mine is up to a little bit of a cup. It's just a little bit above the line, um, but that's okay. And I'm going to pour it right in my bowl, just like that. And then a serving of milk is about one cup, half a cup to a cup, depending on how you want your cereal. Um, I like to have a little bit more milk than cereal personally. Um, so then I got my wet measuring cup. So this one's for liquids um, and then this one's for dry ingredients. Uh, and so on this one, it's a little bit harder to see because it's glass, but this line right here is the full one cup. Um, so I'm gonna take my milk. I'm gonna be careful. Since mine's full, I'm gonna use two hands just to make sure that I don't spill it anywhere. And I am going to just fill it up. And then I'm going to check it. So to check it, you want to make sure that whenever you're holding it level, it's best to look at it if it's on a countertop, um, which I know it's a little hard to see right now. But whenever it's on a countertop, you want it to be right even with that line. So now you can see my, measure, my measurements on the cup, um, and I have my milk to one cup. And so from here, I'm going to be very careful, and I'm going to pour it right into my cereal. And so... I have about an equal amount of cereal to milk ratio, um, a one to one. And I'm just gonna go ahead and put my lid back on my milk. And then with my cereal box, I am going to take it. And I know at school we use the chip clips, but here at home I don't have any chip clips right now. So I'm just gonna roll it down as tight as I can get it to get all the air out to make sure that it keeps my cereal nice and crisp. That way it doesn't get stale. Um, and then I'm going to close up the box and I'm going to put all of my stuff up um, where they go. So, closed up my box, I've closed up my milk, and I'm going to set those aside that way I can go ahead and finish my video. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and grab my spoon. And then make sure you have your spoon. And then I like to let my uh, cereal get a little bit soggy, but that's just me personally. Um, yeah, so that's why I make cereal. Um, I hope that y'all had a great Easter with your families and that y'all have a great week. List down below in the comments what y'all's favorite cereal is. Like I said, mine's Lucky Charms. It's always been that way. And I honestly don't think I'll ever stop eating them. Okay, bye y'all. I hope y'all have a good week.